what happened on for week 229 on HRT since I started HRT um I recently got a letter from the workforce services for the insurance to do a review and all that so I made those appointments so I have those appointments to go to. It's like the same reviews I had to do last year. Um, then that was the second letter they sent. Well, the first stuff they sent is what I had to fill out for the review and all that. Then they sent that one was the third letter. Make those two appointments. Then the other letter they sent, um, they are saying I had to go to the nearest Social Security's office and apply for Social Security disability. So I did that Monday. Yeah. And. I have an appointment set up. I got some other stuff in the mail from them that I had to fill out and whatnot. And gather up some stuff to take with and yeah. So hopefully because I'm more down the insurance and whatnot, it's gonna help more gang on the SSI. And that could take care of one thing. Hopefully this goes good. So that's a big thing that's happening. That will help so I can start saving some money for surgery. And on that note, I was thinking surgery wise, um, cause how expensive it is. I don't have the, like money to go see Marcy Bowers. That's who I want to see for my surgery. That's gonna be like twenty-three thousand dollars, unless it's gone up since I've contacted them about the pricing last. Um, so I was thinking at the University of Miami Research Center where they do the surgery there, um, which is that was eight thousand last I checked. Um, I'm thinking about going there because it's cheaper and. It'll be more affordable for my situation, um, but I'm still debating on that because that would be to get the surgery and get it done and over with. And yeah, and I'm really, really thinking about natural augmentation. Um, when I get back on the prescriptions correctly, the HRT, if things don't, I know they're going to get fuller, but I don't know if they're, my breasts will gain a cup size or not. I know they'll become fuller back to where, mostly where they were beforehand, um, being filled up with all those hormones. Yeah. Um, and if they don't get where I'm hoping they will get, then I'm still thinking about natural augmentation. So I'm not quite sure though. I'd rather spend the money on the surgery down there because that's priority. So, and other issues, body hair is still doing the same thing, um, nothing really has changed much, I'm still thinking of joining a dating site, I'm just trying to figure out which one now, um, after I get everything situated with the SSI and whatnot, I'm thinking about joining a dating site, and 
I'm over projects I'm thinking doing finishing my book um, and getting a new bicycle and turning it into like a motorized bike but in steampunk style and getting more um, steampunk outfits or like towards that Victorian steampunk kind of a thing and creating outfits around that um, and some of the things that has been on my mind lately um, other than that um, not really big huge changes um, just getting by the best I can and waiting for these appointments um, I just have to wait for the Vision Workforce Services, DWS, to send the letters saying when my appointments are. And do that, get that done. Then, so I don't lose the insurance. Then, next month on the 1st is when my appointment is for. Social Security, and hopefully that goes, then they can get all the stuff they need to get within a really short time, so I don't have to wait up to three months to get stuff. Um, hopefully they can get the, all the records and everything else they needing soon, within like couple of weeks then that will help and be on my way to be saving money for my surgery again and yeah getting everything stable back on track with my transition and start getting laser then I'll be able to start getting laser again which is that's going to be a number one thing and my prescriptions those are the two things on my list especially getting back on the prescriptions the HRT is going to help a lot I'm just hoping further development and after that I'll see where things are if like my breasts continue to grow and if they do hopefully they do and see where they get and hopefully they get at least one cup size bigger like a full cup size bigger is what I'm hoping like a large 37 inches like a large 36 and a half to a large 37 and I have more likely 37 to 37 and a half inches on top that's what I'm hoping to get um, then if so then more likely I may or may not get augmentation cause I'm thinking if I get there that's good and if not I want to I want to get augmentation, like natural augmentation, to get them there so they won't be underdeveloped, so they'll be fully where they should be. And, but surgery is more important down there, so still thinking between these two surgeons, like Marcy Bowers and I think it's pronounced, her name's Dr. Sill. Gardo, or however you pronounce that, it's between those two. I'm thinking Morris Bear is definitely I want to go to, but if I can't, if I'm not able to save up that much. Um, and the other surgeon at the University of Miami Research Center where they do the surgery there, hopefully, I can get a, the money saved within. 
about a year or so, like eight months to a year. And, um, yeah, get there. And getting all this done, get a therapist again, which is, I need to talk to my therapist that retired about getting a letter for surgery. So that would be the first letter, because you have to have two, which I think that's stupid. You have to have two letters, but that would be one of them. Because I still have the bill I need to pay him, so when I do that, I'll contact them about the letter at the same time and get all that worked out, and yeah. Then, for my insurance, I'm on to see who they want me to go to and be and yeah for like the therapist I call just who yeah and get the second letter and yeah so other than that that's what's going on right now in my life so Until um, next time, comment, rate, and subscribe, and click the link for my blog if you haven't checked out my blog. Sorry I haven't done blogs yet. I'm waiting until I'm able to get all the videos uploaded and get all that up to date. And I'll be working on the blog because I have a bunch of them planned. So, yeah.